Okay, so no theme music, not interesting, uh, no sound equipment, no props, just a guy in what has become a storage room that used to be an office and looks like I'm digging it out. Entering into the world of doing podcasting and media. This is what I figured I'd wind up doing when I took my hiatus uh, from the world of skateboarding industry and all that. So what I've got set up here presently is I have, um, I have a very messy, hilarious uh, office. I've got, um, uh, I've got a, a YouTube live stream and so YouTube can see that I've got my dog on the ground. He's sleeping right where he belongs. Um, next to the iPad with the YouTube live stream, I've got my Podbean recording. Max 90 minutes. It'd be a great name on Podbean. We're at 1 minute and 28 seconds right now. And um, I just... Uh, figure that it would be best if I just started and use these early episodes and the likelihood that the very few people will listen to them um, anytime soon. Uh, use this period of time to um, uh, find my footing in putting my voice and my words out in a, such a strange time in my view. Um, I'm wa I've been watching for three years. Um, I stepped away from working in the skate industry, uh, and um, I just wanted to take stock. And I wanted to see if there were a place where I could uh, make a further contribution, having already started the maker's movement and having um, done my fair best to encourage and give away um, the kind of tech I was using to make skateboards and having had my fair say in issues around ethics and um, industry, I felt like it was probably a pretty good idea for me to, um, to just uh, uh, take a few steps back. Um, I did wind up becoming, uh, I guess, I'm kind of ambivalent about it, but I became a Harley mechanic. My, my boss, who is uh, pretty amazing, technician who runs a really great shop. Um, he was my fourth shop I worked with and uh, he happily declared me a mechanic. It was a big deal to me. Um, I don't feel like I don't feel like what I th think of when I see a mechanic uh, because when I look at mechanics uh, I tend to perceive that they know everything. And the reality of it is that uh, a, a huge portion of uh, anything that you do professionally is figuring it out as you go and searching for answers and gaining experience that might wind up shortening the process. I just wanted to do tire changes and oil changes and things like that. I wanted to take a break and get some space from uh, some of the mayhem that I had witnessed in the skateboarding industry and uh, just focus on bikes and enjoy building a skill set. Um, what actually happened was more like a process of, I would say pulling teeth, but maybe it was more like having teeth hammered in. <laughs> so um, I find it ironic. I'm, I'm on a live stream on YouTube, but I don't have a thousand followers and they say I can't do them, but uh, they went ahead and seemed to have allowed me to do this live stream. So if you're listening on Podbean at any time, I'm going to wind up posting this uh, live stream there as well. Um, well, we're almost five minutes in, and I, I feel pretty talked out. I, I just want to get on the horse and um, do that. You know, I, I rode horses as a child. I grew up on a small horse farm, and um, we never, you know, snapped the reins and said, Yeah! <laughs> But it sure feels good to say, yeah. 
what kind of horse we're riding, and uh, I'm having connection issues over there. So on Podbean, none of these connection issues will register because it's a pure audio experience at this point. But I find it strange that someone's on my live stream because YouTube told me I'm not allowed to do live streams because I don't have enough followers. And it hurts. It doesn't hurt. <laughs> nothing, nothing hurts when you're already dead, friends. <laughs> so, yeah, we've got Rocco asleep on the floor. We've got the uh, Podbean audio recording going on. And I'm just saying hello to all of you friends and maybe will be friends and maybe won't be friends anymore. I don't know. It's the Wild West when you get into free speech and free thought. And uh, I have to exhibit a certain amount of respect for the fact that going on a journey of podcasting with all of you here from this erstwhile studio, which is uh, it was my office, and then it became storage for uh, resale stuff during the, the Great Plague of... 19 and uh boy you just want to shake that out don't you but yeah so this is an audio check this is an exploration of uh the tech this is an exploration of the space as i'm hoeing out this area and figuring out but it's just an ipad and an iphone uh no special mics uh coming up this uh friday and saturday and sunday my partner in crime and uh, erstwhile co-host, I think I said erstwhile already once, albeit there, I said albeit too, um, I talk like that, um, my, my co-host and super good friend and amigo, Luke um, Coffee, we will be heading to the Cleveland area for a meetup with a bunch of Life Skateboards folks. Um, I ride for live skateboards. I don't know what I mean by ride for. But um, I uh, play with skateboards in the name of life skateboards. <laughs> for, for what it's worth, for what it's worth, for what it's worth. This was uh, just a few minutes with Captain Lou. We're coming up on the eight minute mark. I'm going to cut it off. and um, And of course, things will take form in the future. I greet you. And I hope that we get to root around some things that will help and challenge us all to grow. I'll catch you on the flip side. All right, I'm going to shut down the YouTube now. Let's see. I touched the screen. Nothing happened. Here you go. Podbean, you get to listen on. <laughs>